Balaam's prophet. I shall see him, referring to Jesus Christ, but not now. I shall behold him, but not nigh. It wasn't time. There shall come a star or a prince out of Jacob and a scepter. There's that sign of authority, the kingship, the scepter of the king shall rise out of Israel and shall smite the corners of Moab and destroy all the children of Sheth. This is a bad translation. This last word, Seth, was the second son of Eth Ha'adam, uh, the book of Genesis. Uh, this word, Sheth, in the Hebrew is, if you translate it, is confusion or Babylon. And old sister Babylon is going to be destroyed all right when Jesus returns. David, in 2 Samuel chapter 8, verses 1 and 2, got a pretty good start on destroying Moab. But Jesus will utterly destroy Moab. Why? Because they seduced Israel into idolatry. No room for that. And notice the star following that verse. That means in most of your Bibles you have a star there. And that indicates that scholars agree that that refers to Messiah. And Edom, that's Rush, Russia of today, shall be a possession. Whoa, they're, they're trying to possess other people's territory now. But they're going to be a possession, that old bear, Rush. Seir also shall be a possession for his enemies, and Israel shall do valiantly, will uh, do, be prosperous, if you will, with Christ at the helm. Out of